family matters. What guides the record? Love challenge number four. A friend loves at all times. Proverbs 17 verse 17 states that a friend loves at all times. Have you ever met someone who excitedly told you they were your friend and you realized you did not know them? The truth is, in spite of the many friends, including those on social media that we have today, some people are still experiencing a sense of loneliness. This is because real friendships take time to develop and must be cultivated. The Bible tells us that if we want friends, we must show ourselves friendly. Most people at one time or another have experienced hurt from a friend they loved and cared about. However, if we are rooted and grounded in the love of God, we can continue to love that friend even if they have hurt or offended us. The Word of God tells us in the book of Proverbs 17 verse 17 that a friend loves at all times. This is because the love of God in us should provoke strong friendships and bonds of love that can spread the love of God around to as many persons as He desires. For any type of friendship to last, it must be genuine and be so built on a foundation of love and truth that they can withstand offenses, adversities, jealousies, a need to separate for various reasons, and anything else they may face. Jesus is our example. He was a friend of sinners, yet he did not take on their friendship with the evil systems of worldliness. His sole motive was for them to experience the love of God that they needed to save their souls. Even though he was betrayed, denied, and wounded in the house of those he called his friends, he chose to demonstrate a greater love by laying down his life for his friends. He therefore earnestly desires for us to be perfectly in love so that we will not be moved by offenses now or even in an increasingly anti-Christian system where Jesus warns us that many will be betrayed even by those we love dearly and consider to be our close friends. Scripture in Focus Romans 5 verse 5 And hope maketh not ashamed, because the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost which is given unto us. Proverbs 18 verse 24 A man that hath friends must shew himself friendly, and there is a friend that sticketh closer than a brother. Proverbs 17 verse 17 A friend loveth at all times, and a brother is born for adversity. Zechariah 13 verse 6 And one shall say unto him, What are these wounds in thine hands? Then he shall answer, Those with which I was wounded in the house of my friends. Reflect and respond. Is there a friendship you have that has been severed by hurt, offenses, neglect, indifference, or for whatever reason love is just not flowing? What will it take to restore this friendship? And is any price too high to walk in the pure healing love of God in you? God is faithful to reveal this to you and bring to your mind friendships that must be nurtured to bring glory and honor to His name. Just obey Him. Spend some time praying for and reaching out to those friends God lays on your heart today. This is day four of a 10-day challenge. Remember, you can walk in love as a lifestyle by the power of the Holy Spirit. Written by Pastor Andrew and Donnett Norman and read by Kiana Brown. This Word Vibes Love Challenge is brought to you by Passion and Purity in association with Interschool Christian Fellowship, ICF, Christian Teachers in Action, Marriage is Honorable, and the Eternal Church of Jesus Christ, the Record, 